Yeah. Okay, next is solve the equation. Uh, when solving the equation, you want to find x equals to what? Okay, so here you have two brackets together. What do you need to do? Rainbow, rainbow in, okay? So we get x squared, because x times x is x squared, x times 2 is 2x, then plus x plus 2 equals to 6 minus 5x. So <coughs> we will rearrange x squared plus 3x plus 2 minus 6 plus 5x equal to 0. Right? Okay, rearrange again x squared uh, plus 8x minus 4 equals to 0. Now, here's the tricky part. What do I need to do next? I need to factorize. How to factorize? <coughs> Which method do you learn to factorize? Cross. Is it a cross multiplication? Okay, so we do the cross multiplication way. This one x squared minus 4 8x x cannot doesn't work okay so we are going to check let's check the calculator for maybe we can use the formula Okay, so you use the formula negative x minus b plus minus square root b square minus 4ac over 2a. You find that x equals to 0 0.472 or x equals to negative 8.47. Okay, because you cannot use normal uh, factorization to get it. Okay, that's the tricky part. Right, next we do more indices. Now for the next part, simplify. So we need to combine these two. Um, it's actually quite simple. It's a uh, two because there are no numbers here, so it's just two uh, together. X times x power four. Because x power x times x power four become x power five, and then y to the power five. Oh, this all. Okay, next one. Next is cancellation. Now you look at 27 and 9 can divide by? 3. Divide by 9. You get 3 straight away. Then uh, here cancel the P cube left with P. Right, and here cancel the Q4 left Q cube. So that's the answer. Whoa, 3 marks. Okay, that's the answer. Then the next one. Uh, now this is power 0. Anything to power 0 will give you Chocolate bar, no. What's chocolate bar? It's 1. So it's 4 times 1. 4. Remember, anything to the power of 0, anything to the power of 0 is 1. So the answer is just, I mean, it's 1 over here. Isn't it amazing? <laughs> okay, next. Okay, here. Now we have a divide. You must change what? Times, yes, right. So 5 to the power of n over p q square times p q r over 5 n plus 3. Right, and then I combine. Now, before I combine, I can do some cancellation using a color. Uh, what to cancel the p and the p gone? No more p q and 1 q gone. All right, let's write it out and see what happens. What else we can do? So it becomes y to the power of n times r, right? Because pq gone anymore. Divided by uh, q, oh sorry, 5 to the power of n plus 3 times q at the bottom. So it's still not good enough. Why? Because there are other things to do. Okay, let me let me just shape it up here. Now what other things can we do? Five to the power of n r divided by is times r. Uh, this, this one five to the power of n plus three is actually five to the power of n times five to the power of three. Then times q again. 
Okay. So now my phi n phi n yeah it's gone. So left with r over 135 cube because phi cube is 135. That's my answer. Okay, your turn. <laughs>